I'm here at Jacob's House, located in the middle of Temecula. Since 2013, it has been a saving grace for distraught families dealing with loved ones in the hospital. To date, Jacob's House has helped more than 1,000 families in need. The house assists with lodging, meals, laundry, and ancillary services free of charge. To accommodate these services as a nonprofit, it is no surprise that the organization deals with financial troubles. In an effort to lower utility expenses, the board of directors wanted to install solar panels, but quickly learned it came with a big ticket price. Fortunately, many volunteers stepped up to provide a light at the end of the tunnel. Who spearheaded the donations for this solar project? In this case, it sort of all came together almost by itself. Um, so it was, you know, um, a project that we knew we, need, we wanted and needed but we couldn't quite get over the cost of it. And then all of a sudden, out of the blue, we got a phone call from the owner of uh, Transform Power in Temecula, and he was looking for a charitable cause that he could uh, donate his uh, services to. And he agreed that he would donate the, uh, the labor towards a uh, solar installation. And that brought the cost of the thing way down. And he talked to his suppliers and they were able to give him some discounts on materials. About that same time, you know, we had been aware of 100 women who care to make it a valley. Uh, luckily, uh, fortunately, we were able to receive their grant. And it was 52 of their members, and they each wrote a check for $100 each. It also turns out that when 100 women who care to make it a valley, when they uh, provide a donation to a local charity, uh, Best Buy matches 50% uh, of their contribution. So that brought us even closer. Even with all this help, Jacob's House still needed more funds to complete the project. And fortunately, a community member stepped up. There was an individual that became aware of what we were doing and wanted to donate. Uh, this person came by, uh, made a very generous donation to Jacob's House and put us over the top. And he did so in memory of his deceased daughter he was really moved by what we do at Jacob's House, and we were very moved by his contribution. And there is a message inscribed on one of the solar panels up on the roof to his daughter in her memory. And every time we look at that solar installation, we, we remember that and we remember her. Yeah, that is the perfect example of community support. Yeah, and you know, the beautiful thing about it, it brought a huge benefit to us, not in terms, only in terms of the money that we needed, but also, you know, by knocking out our electric bill for, you know, perpetuity or 15 years, that's a huge monthly savings to us. Um, you know, we sort of operate on a thin margin. You know, we, we it's all donations, it's all volunteers. So that knocking out our electric bill is a big deal for us.